Hello, OJX is in Malaysia, and welcome to an education video about AFT and DAO file. Well, today we will be talking about how we could use AFT and DAO file to our advantage in OJX department. So, first off, before we start off, there are a few materials that we could refer to. If you guys have any further details that you guys would like to know, these are the materials that you guys could refer to. And these materials are available in our SOP, which is on the Malaysia Isaac's Isaac Malaysia's wiki, uh, wikis. So you guys could look it up on myisaac.net. All right. So we will start off by saying, um, what is available form tracker and what is AFT? So AFT is basically a current state analysis, which is something that we have or a data that we gain that we have right now currently on myisaac.net it is a file that is uh, changed into an excel file for viewing offline purposes so how to use an AFT file and which is what we are we will be talking about in this video and I'll be showing to you guys how you guys could use this and maybe we want to know why use AFT so why do we use AFT alright so AFT is used if we are not online and we wish to use it offline so which is why we could use AFT sometimes first off we'll be learning how to use filtering in our information uh, in the Excel file. First off, we'll just open the latest AFT file which I got from myisaac.net, the AFT for February 2013. First, uh, how to filter is, is that we highlight this column, the first one, and then we'll go on to data and click on filter. Once we click filter, we could see all those arrows pointing down. And by this, we could easily filter our information by just clicking on for example if I were to uh, look on to just GCDP program so I'll just tick on this one and click OK after that it will just filter everything that is GCDP only and nothing on GIP alright alright so how many TNs are available in April 2013 for example if you want EPs we have EPs that wants to go to uh, GCDP in April this year so we'll just go on to our AFT file and then we would go to we would go to TN by starting date so we'll just scroll down to 2013 and we'll just look onto April 4th means April we could know that easily we could see Argentina they we already have three TNs and um, Brazil we have 11 and so on we could see maybe yeah um, China mainland we have three so that is how we could look and by clicking on it by clicking on it we could see the projects that are there so these are it alright so next how can I look for projects based on issues so maybe sometimes we are we have EPs that wants to go on specific project we could also use the AFT file we just need to go to TN by issues and duration and we just look onto here for example if they're interested to go on environment project so we could just click on double click on this one and we could easily see uh, all that is here that is about environmental projects. 